Good morning, Lincoln, Soda 2, and Cooley Montessori. Today is Friday, March 8th, and it is a day one. Here are your morning announcements. We begin with today's PBIS lesson, commitment. Commitment can be interpreted in different ways. One way to look at commitment at school is to commit to learning. Commit to letting yourself grow and change personally and academically. The Search Institute shares that the more young people are committed to learning, the more likely they are to grow up healthy. Choose to be healthy. Students, we need your help. There has been a lot of garbage and food left out on the playground and the school grounds. A reminder that nothing should be taken out of the lunchroom to the playground. Please make sure to throw away your unwanted items. And if you see something, some garbage left outside, do your part by picking it up and throwing it away. If everyone helps, we can keep our community clean. Color Guard Showcase. The members of the Lacrosse Stars would like to invite you to the Color Guard Showcase this Sunday, April 10th, starting at 6 p.m. at Central High School. This show will feature the performances of the Lacrosse Stars Varsity and JV, as well as the Onalaska High School and UWL Winter Guards, including a short performance from our Lincoln Middle Winter Drumline. Admission is free and we hope to see you there. Author visit coming up to the, to the main branch library on Wednesday, April 13th at 6 p.m. Newberry Award winner Meg Medina will be having a free presentation at the library. She will also be visiting Logan and Central. Hope you have a chance to go and listen to her speak. Today's Lincoln leader, eighth grader Ben. Ben is an excellent role model for his peers. He is always on time and prepared to, for class, does his best work and follows classroom rules. I appreciate his respect and responsibility. How many seconds are there in a year? How many? Twelve. Huh? January 2nd, February 2nd, March 2nd, April 2nd, May 2nd, uh, June 2nd, uh, July 2nd, August 2nd, uh, September 2nd, October 2nd, November 2nd, and December 2nd. The answer to last week's trivia question was the nation of Uganda. Thanks for participating. This week's trivia takes us to a country in Southeast Asia. This country is landlocked and bordered by five countries, including China, Vietnam, and Thailand. This country is home to the Mekong River, and nearly three quarters of the nation is covered by mountainous terrain. And one final fact, coffee is this nation's largest export. Can you name this country? After a, week, after a week of steady rain, here's a look at a dry weekend weather forecast. Today we'll see partly cloudy skies and highs around 40 degrees. Saturday we'll expect to see a little more sun bringing our highs to around 50 degrees. We will get another day of 50s on Sunday with partly cloudy skies as we look forward to another potentially rainy and stormy week to fo follow. And that's a look at your weekend weather. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.